Hi, boys and girls. This is completely optional, but if you're interested in learning how to use your oil pastels and draw a snowman, this video is for you. If you aren't interested in using your oil pastels to draw a snowman, no problem, you don't have to do it, but I do expect you to be quiet while the rest of your friends are listening. Now with this little snowman, if I cover him up, if I cover part of him up, you can see that this side over here is in the shadow. So that's what we can do when we're drawing to make something look like it's a sphere, like our globes up there, if we make sure that we put a highlight. And now imagine that you're in the snow with your snowman and it's sort of dusk. We would probably use cool colors to draw that. Blues and purples and whites, maybe a little green, but in this case, I'm going to use some blues and purples to make that highlight. So watch this video, maybe draw a snowman and practice experimenting with your oil pastels. One of the things I love about working with oil pastels is that you can layer them so easily. So you're going to see that I'm going to start with your basic three circle snowman, three little circles stacked on top of each other, and I add a little bit of a horizon line behind it because nobody likes a creepy floating snowman. And then I'm going to color in those circles. After I color in the circles, I need to determine which side I want the sun or the light to be hitting my snowman. In this case, I have an imaginary sun in the upper right hand corner of my work of art. You'll see what I mean in a minute. So while I'm not going to draw that sun, I do want to remind myself that the sun would be hitting the right side of my snowman, making the left side in the shadows. And since I'm using cool colors, I'm going to start adding my shadows with a little bit of blue. And that's what you can see me layering on right now. Oil pastels blend really well. So once I've added blue on the shadow part of my snowman, I'm going back over the blue with white to sort of blend it in. In a minute, you'll notice that I'm going to add just a little bit of purple on the very, very far side. And this way, it looks like that part that's on the opposite side of the sun that's in the shadow is definitely in the shadow, but we're using a color that would be more appropriate for the winter time. Instead of black, we're using purples and blues. Another way I can make sure that this is pretty realistic looking is by adding a shadow to the ground. Now remember, we want the shadow to be on the side where the sun isn't hitting. So on the same side where we have the highlights, we're going to use our same blues and purples to make a little bit of a shadow over there. You can see I'm using both blue and purple. And then I go back in and blend it. And you can see there I'm defining the edge just a little bit more of my snowman. Once I've got all those shading details done, another thing I love about oil pastels is that they layer, like I said, really, really well. Once I've done this, I can go ahead and add all my extra details, like a hat, a scarf, nose, etc. I'm going to speed it up so you can watch the rest. And there you have a winter snowman. You could do it on purple paper or blue paper, or really any color you want, but I can't wait to see yours when it's done.